Now, big name companies making cell phones, laptops, and electric vehicles are changing out their lithium ion battery. Now, they're going with a more energy efficient option that'll save you money, but it'll also keep you safe. Andy Taylor's checking out the latest technology. Batteries, something you don't necessarily think about on a regular basis, unless you hear about these stories on the news. Lithium batteries exploding. What you can buy today is very good, but it also comes at the price of being very risky. One company called Solid Power is changing the battery game, making them lighter, safer, and more energy efficient by using a solid state electrolyte. In a conventional lithium ion, you have what the, essentially what is a liquid electrolyte that enables the ions to go back and forth. In solid state battery, you're basically just replacing that liquid electrolyte with a solid uh, ion conducting material. Which basically means a solid state battery can never explode and weighs a lot less. We rely on lithium ion batteries every day from our cell phones, laptops, and electric vehicles. Solid Power CEO makes it clear that lithium batteries are perfectly safe, but they have the potential to become unsafe. In solid state, you can, you can still fail, i.e. short circuit, uh, but it's a very benign failure. You basically just have a dead battery and it doesn't catch on fire, explode. We got an inside look at how they make solid power batteries. Now, Doug says big name companies like BMW, Hyundai, and Ford will all be using solid power batteries soon. He also says they would be a game changer for the military. Our military is incre increasingly electrified. Troops in the field carry, you know, tens of pounds of batteries when they go into to combat. Um, so you could see where if I could reduce the weight burden of those batteries, I can make them safer. And when it comes to price, with every new technology, it's going to cost more up front. But as demand grows, that the cost of that uh, battery system itself goes down. I'm Annie Taylor reporting.